Hi everyone, welcome back to JIV. In this video, I am going to share very common interview question. So our question here is find the largest and smallest number from an array. Suppose you have an array something like this. So you need to find the smallest and largest number from this array. If you manually do this, the smallest number will be this 93 and the largest number will be 73. There are two ways to do this. The first one way is using the Java 8 and there is one more way second way which is comparing the elements of this array with each other so in this video i am going to show you both the ways first i will tell you how you can solve this problem using the java 8 so i will copy this array from here and i will go to my main method inside main method i will paste it just to create an array now i have to find the largest and smallest so first I will convert this array into a string. To convert any array into a string, there is a method of array, arrays dot stream. And inside that you need to pass that array which you want to convert into stream. After converting this array into a stream, there are few methods like max is there, max function is there, and there is min function also. So you, you can use this to find the smallest and largest. So first I will find the min get as int because this min will return uh, optional here optional so and then I will create the variable called smallest and this variable is a type of integer. I will copy this statement here and make this largest and here I will put max function and at the end I will print both these the smallest number is smallest and then I will copy this quickly and paste it over here the largest number is largest I will run this program it should print the max and min I mean the smallest and largest so as you can see it is printing the smallest number and the largest number so this was our first way let's do it with the another way which is comparing the elements of this array with each other now to do this first to compare elements of this array i will use a loop i will iterate this array from the first element to very last element and i will compare the elements with each other now to do that first i will create some variables variable like smallest and largest I will initialize this smallest with the first element of an array I mean you can initialize these with anything any integer but that integer should be inside this array okay so after creating these two variable what I will do I will iterate this array so for this I will create a loop to iterate over this array and uh, I will iterate from the first element of course you can iterate from zeroth element as well but uh, I will tell you later why it is not so important and I will iterate from the first element from first element to the very last element till the length of this array and here inside this for loop I will put a condition I will put a condition that uh, okay so the logic will be very simple to do this I will put a if condition inside the if condition I will compare I will compare the values how I will compare I will take the largest first I will compare the largest number with the each element of this array so for this what I will do I will take each element from this array and compare it with the largest number whatever is there in the largest number so whenever this finds anything any number from this array which is larger than the largest number so that number will be the largest number so then what I will do I will put that number inside the largest variable just stick with me I will explain this by iterating each element also so I will create another if condition and inside that I will pick the element which we are iterating and compare it with the smallest number this time and the, this is also pretty straightforward we are comparing the element of this array which we are iterating with the smallest number with whatever is there inside the smallest and if our number is smaller than the smallest number I mean whatever is there in the smallest then we will put that thing that value inside the smallest variable and after the 
every iteration of the loop the smallest variable will have smallest value and the largest variable will have largest value so i will at the end i will print them as well and let's copy this largest now if i run this program it should print the smallest and the largest number something like this so yeah our code is working fine now i will explain again that how this is working so suppose we are iterating from the first element i mean whatever is there in the first position so in the zeroth position we have 23 and at the first position we have 56 okay and in the smallest and largest we are assigning 23 and 23 here as well so then while iterating first we are iterating for the 56 and we are comparing 56 with the largest number which is 23 of course 56 is bigger than 23 that means in the largest number i mean largest variable we will put 56 and in the smallest uh, here we are comparing smallest number with 56 of course 23 is smaller than the 56 then this condition will not fulfill and we have 23 as smallest number says here and the next step in the next iteration we have 73 which we are iterating and it will again compare with the largest number here now while comparing it counts that largest number is 73 because 73 is bigger than 56 then we will assign in the largest number we will assign 73 and while doing these iteration we will reach at minus 93 and uh, we will compare 93 with the current smallest number which is which may be any smallest number maybe 12 that time so uh, while comparing it it counts that 93 is smaller than the uh, number which is there in the smallest variable that time so 93 will replace that number and in the smallest we have 93 assigned so it will iterate the entire array by the end of the all the iteration it will have the largest and smallest number as well so this is a pretty simple way to solve this problem i hope this video will be helpful for you just let me know in the comment section how you are feeling about the content and uh, thank you